food manufacturing represents 2% of the GDP in Spain, and it is one of the main manufacturers worldwide. However, even though supermarkets or big corporates like Carrefour or Mercadona are digitalized, food factories are not. There is a big inefficiency in their processes because they don't collect data. Specifically, they waste millions on food and plastic waste. At Bolston, we are building a robust solution that reduces waste in factories. How do we achieve that? Our solution uses algorithms that detect errors during the production process. So in that case, the problem is solved and is not being extended in time. The data is analyzed and shown on an intuitive platform that allows for real-time alerts and analytics on production lines. We are doing this through computer vision cameras we install in critical points of the production process. We interview more than 10 factories and it's evident that there are common problems in the industry. Even though the problem is different, the solution is the same. We are already working with these two factories validating our solution. It saves around 65% of their fruit and plastic waste. Our business model is the following one. We are an enterprise SaaS for food factories where we charge the factory for an upfront fee, which includes the whole service for the first year. Um, and this includes the installation of the cameras, the different models and access to the platform. After the first year, the client pays an annual subscription, which includes performance checks every quarter assistance and maintenance, any emergency help, and the data storage. We don't have a fixed price as this would change for each client depending on the number of models and cameras we need to install. We are operating in one of the fastest growing industries. The AI for food industry is growing at a 45% a year, which means that while the market right now is valued at 3 billion, it will be 30 in five years. Our target are food factories with an annual revenue of at least 5 million. This amounts to 6,000 uh, food factories in Spain. Our goal is to reach two clients by the end of Q2, so in the next uh, couple of months, and eight by the, uh, by the end of the year. Next year, our goal is to reach 40 more clients, which represents an opportunity of, of 1.5 million. Um, we have different competitors, but, but the main one, uh, would be Overview. Uh, they are based in San Francisco. They apply a similar technology as us, but to the automotive industry. Y Combinator has invested in them, which shows a great interest uh, in this particular technology from key investment players. So we are working with these two beta testers at this moment. Um, uh, and actually, uh, last week, we installed the first module in one production line. In the following two weeks, we will make some adjustments and install the cameras in nine new lines. Our goal is to, to monetize it this month. In April also, we will raise our first round. And in June, we will start uh, extending our technical use cases. In addition, we will make our team bigger and that will improve our product with new features. And lastly, our team. Um, so these four are, uh, we are the co-founders. Pablo is in charge of our finances and operations. He has worked at investment banking overseeing numerous funding rounds and M&A. Additionally, his family has one of the largest snacks manufacturers in Spain, where he worked for a few years. Romana is our CMO. She has worked at, as a marketing manager at large technology companies in London and Toronto. Karim is our CTO. He's an industrial engineer who has also worked as software developer for last consultancies in France and Spain and myself, who I've, I have multiple years of experience leading major accounts teams for companies like Microsoft in London. We are Boston and we are here to help you increase the profitability of your food factory.